Ever been riding your bike up the bike track and all of a sudden realise you've got a flat tyre? Well, it's more than likely you've just ridden through a patch of cow trot. I'm James Donnelly from the Adelaide and Mount Lofty Ranges Natural Resources Management Board. Today we're looking at a real nuisance weed called cow trot. Cow trot can be identified by these long prostrate stems which grow very quickly in ideal conditions. The leaves are opposite on each branchlet. It can have yellow or white flowers and a long single taproot. The seed capsules are hard and very spiky and can be easily transported in bike tyres, car and trailer tyres, pram tyres and in the feet of pets and livestock. Cowtrop is an annual plant and starts to appear in early summer. Its ideal growing conditions are flat, open ground with little competition. It will germinate, spread and set seed in a very short space of time and the seeds will last for many years, making it very difficult to control. When spraying cow chop, start from the middle and spray out along each of the runners out to the growing tip. It's important not to miss any of the plant. When the seeds are becoming hard and dried, they are reaching maturity. So spraying will not be an appropriate option because you may kill the plant, but the seed will still be viable to germinate again next year. In this instance, you will need to dig up the plant by hand or with a mattock. When removing cow chop by hand, you can either use your fingers with a glove or you can use a mattock such as this. But it's very important to ensure you get the whole tap root out each time, whichever method you choose. So start by working your fingers under the plant, pinching the root system and tap root as low as you can and pulling it out, making sure you remove the entire tap root. It's the same when digging with a mattock, just dig low enough to make sure that you are able to grab the entire tap root of the plant. And it may be appropriate for you to put that plant in a bag with all the seeds still attached and perhaps rake up any seeds that are still on the ground. Now before you leave, check for any seeds that might be stuck in your shoes. You will need to remove the seeds so that you don't help the spread of this declared weed.